Here's an example of self-sabotage right away. I know, I know. I know that already. Self-sabotage is where I personally know information about myself. I get it. I get the full picture of it, but I still am not giving to myself completely in all the ways of an expansive love. So I know what I want. I know what I desire. I know what I need. I know all those things, but I'm not giving to myself in the best of ways so I can achieve everything in that giving because self-sabotage is actually helping to pull apart what I could achieve and what my success can be. So self-sabotage takes literally the only the best things you want for yourself you get. And that's what I do. I get the best things for myself. And when you pull away from something and understand it, when I've pulled away from things and understood it, when I've talked about things by myself and with my girlfriend and looked at everything, what I'm achieving in my relationship, what I'm achieving in my personal life, what I'm achieving in my work, I look at it and I go, oh, okay, that's a part of what self-sabotage is actually. Self-sabotage sometimes is exactly what we were, what I was. So it's as simple as not giving into the same techniques and actions that are horrendous now. They're not supposed to be one thing, and they're definitely not supposed to be that thing now. Something like green lighting. Something like, even going further back, not looking for my future. Not looking for it. Never did. I was asked by my girlfriend, hey, what's, what did you think about your future in your past? Well, I didn't. I didn't think past my future. Literally, I just thought of my present. What do I got to do today? What do I got to do today? And not in a way that's very much like growing. You know, I didn't grow even in those moments. Even if I did, there was nobody around me growing. So in that growing, it was pretty much self-contained and you can't and i can't really grow by myself in that way no one can because there's no growth in that everyone in context around it if i'm growing has to be growing too or at least have that desire and want to and that's what i learned about self sabotage it's literally taking apart everything that i've achieved in that moment because hey there's something that says i don't deserve it but that's not how I feel at all and that's not where I want to be and that's not where I want to achieve and have success I want to give my most prominent self to myself and to the person I love and to the people that I'm surrounded by and understand that everything else around that is replaceable because if anything else tries to taint what I'm doing, including myself. Self-sabotage has to be understood in that so that I can say, no, fuck you, self-sabotage. You're not going to step in my way for the success I want, for the love that I want to give, for the love that I have in myself. Love you all.